going on you guys lou back at it again with another video now for today's video we're gonna be talking about the golden state warriors and talking about their conditions are they done you know what i'm saying as in done i mean like are they done going to like the finals are they done even going to the playoffs is this something that you know is done done and yeah yeah man i mean I was real optimistic coming into this season. I'm not going to lie. You know, I was really optimistic. I saw some of their moves. I saw little free agent pickups and, you know, even D'Angelo Russell. And, you know, what I'm not going to lie about is that I seen this and I'm not saying that they were going to be a championship S team, but I thought there could still be a future there with this team. And I'm not saying one game does everything, but from just looking at the roster, looking at how it could come together, I don't see a style of basketball i just see like trying to build something and i'm not saying that can't be built but it just doesn't seem like it's gonna add up this season nor next season this is gonna take some time and the warriors gotta make some moves happen with this um i don't know you know it, it was really bad but what i can say about the clippers is they the real deal you know what i'm saying it's the real deal everybody knew it was the real deal this is without paul george you know, this is something that, you know, is going to come together. Kawhi has already proved that he can be on the team and be the solo star and have a great amount of pieces around him. Sorry, I had a phone call there. But regardless of the point, as long as Kawhi has some pieces, he can make it shake, right? And then at the end of the day, you're just going to sit here and add somebody like a Paul George. The team is only going to get better. And at the end of the day, I'm really excited to see what they can do from that point on. I think this is a team that's highly strong. They're going to be just stacked from even the deeper parts of their bench to just their, you know, starters. This is a team that's ready to go, and they proved it in this game. They were up the whole game. Their biggest lead was like 31 points. I just, I couldn't even believe it, man. I mean, this was one of those games I wanted to see what Golden State had, and then I also wanted to see what the Clippers would do. And, you know, Kawhi only played 21 minutes, but he also filled up his box scores. I mean, he did everything, you know what I'm saying? So it's just, I don't know, man. This is crazy that a team that we saw now for the last couple of years be just so dominant and go through different things and phases of how their team was and still just be so dominant. And now to be in this position where we're just seeing their humble downfall, it's a, you know, it's a crazy situation. And I'm not saying that it's done done for them, you know, but I think right now as of what's going on, I think there is going to be some problems that they're going to have to go through. And, you know, it's going to take some time. And I want to see how that plays out. I predicted they would make it to the playoffs. But now, I'm not going to lie, I'm going to make a bold statement. I'm going to take that back. And I think that they may not make the playoffs. I think that there could be a possibility that other teams could possibly slide in because the West is very stacked. So we're going to see what happens. But Golden State may fall out of there. So tell me what you guys think down below in the comments. And if you guys enjoyed Please like and subscribe for more. I'm out.